Alright, now what y'all are seeing right in front of you right now is me going through the process of setting up this whole glitch build setup. I'm not gonna lie to you, I've seen this all over the internet, never really got into it because I always thought maybe it's way more complicated than I will probably get the hang of. But low key, shout out to 2K Mechanic because he has a bunch of videos out on how to set up glitch builds in order to make them. And I personally went through, checked out his setup for how to make it for a point guard, and I'm not gonna lie, it was quick, easy, and we managed to get it done. Hence, how you're now seeing this 6 7 glitched out Lonzo ball build. Hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video. Don't forget, shout out to 2K Mechanic. He's the one who gave me the idea. And yeah, I'll catch you in a bit. Enjoy the video. Hey yo, what do you do? It's your boy Alvin 10 aka AMR10. And as you saw in the prelude to this video, what I've got for you today happens to be my very first glitched build within NBA 2K22 Next Gen. Yes, that's right. I'm losing my glitched build virginity. Now, I'm not going to lie to you. I had posted a video before where I said glitched build, but that was because I didn't know what people meant back there when they were saying glitched. I th thought they just meant the build they thought was unguardable. But it turns out, nah, this means builds that, you know what I'm saying, can get some stuff they're not meant to get, which you get with a little secret trick. But um, before we get into the build video, I just got to say shout out to 2K Mechanic, because low-key, he is the person who I saw this glitched build at video idea off of and low key he is the one who inspired me to make a 6-7 glitch build point guard but the truth was I had to make it around the one the only Lonzo Ball for those of you who don't know I am a Lonzo Ball stan in some ways I don't show it a lot but I am a stan for this man because I believe he is highly talented and highly slept on but hey I felt you know that's right let's make a Lonzo Ball build video now as you know he is a point guard right handed jersey number two for the Chicago Bulls but before we get into the Lonzo Ball full build video, I just got to say, if you're new to the channel and you ain't done so yet, do me a favor, go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below, because as most of you know, we're trying to hit 500 subs. Plus, with this being the very first glitched build video that we do on the channel, you have to show some love to it. And if you like today's video and you want to see more glitch build videos like this, or you want to see any general build videos regarding NBA players, then do me a favor, go ahead and drop a like on the video, because as you know, we always produce when we need to. And if you have a comment on a specific build video you want to see, or you have any specific videos you want to see on the channel, then do me a favor, go ahead and drop a comment down below. More specifically, if you want the next glitched build video to be a Leangelo Ball shooting guard build video, do me a favor, go ahead and comment hashtag free jello down below in the comments. But yeah, as I said, it's a Lonzo Ball build, so you know what that means. We got to go extremely tall with it being about 6'7". Now, Wikipedia says the boy comes in at 6'6", but I believe he's 6'7". Weighs about 190 pounds, but we're gonna put him at 180. And then when it comes to the wingspan, we're gonna match the height and put it at 6'7", because technically, it's believed that human be as human beings, our wingspan is supposed to match our height, but that, you know what I'm saying, ain't fully true. Now, body shape-wise, we are going with Define, just because Lonzo slips in that little compact to Define build, you know what I'm saying? When he was with the Lakers, and the when he was with the Lakers, he was compact when he was with the Hornets he was a little middle ground and now he looks more defined than compact so we're going with defined now today's a weird day by the way because today we found out Tom Brady retires question mark because apparently it might not be true I was kind of upset but now I'm kind of happy because the truth is I am not trying to see the GOAT leave this early and no I am not a Patriots fan now the first thing to mess with is the driving dunk which I will be putting up to a 92 because everybody loves contact dunks in this game and I will also be putting the vertical up to an 80 just so that you can get all elite contact dunks. As I said, I'm not a Patriots fan. I am a New Orleans Saints fan, so I do enjoy beating up on Tom Brady. But I do believe the man is so great, we should not have to see him retire. Because when Tom Brady, LeBron James, KD, Stephen Curry, Kawhi Leonard, when the likes of those guys go, oh, sports is going to feel so different. But yeah, uh, first thing to mess with after dealing with the whole contact dunk situation is I always love to go through the physicals. So I will be giving this build an 85 speed and an 85 excel as well as a 90 on the stamina. I know, yes, usually I do give it a 95 so that you can get a 99, but this time is a little bit different. Then, because it is a Lonzo build, I got to go with the playmaking. And first thing being first, I got to put the speed with ball all the way up to an 80 as well as putting the ball handle, you know what I'm saying, all the way up to an 84. This is just because, you know, that allows me to get that gold hyperdrive because that is something you need. And then when it comes to pass accuracy, I got to put this baby up, son. I got to put this all the way up to a 90 just so I can get gold diner because the truth of it is most of you who watch Lonzo play, he is a playmaking facilitator. Wait, wrong. He is a two-way playmaking facilitator. And because of that, we got to go on to the defensive side of the ball. And this is where this build really stands out. Because with it being glitched, you have the ability to get that sort of ball handle 
and still get an 86 perimeter and an 86 steal with a 65 block at the point guard position. Now, I'm not going to lie. I will not be putting any defense, I'm sorry, any defensive rebounding or offensive rebounding or interior defense just because this is a point guard build. Plus, low key, if you box out, you can really get rebounds with this build. So, you know what I'm saying? You really shouldn't need it like that. Now, the last thing to mess with before the fin obviously the finishing, because we got to tune that up, is going to be the shooting side of the ball. Now, mid range wise, I will give him an 84 just because Lonzo is not known for usually shooting middies a lot. He does shoot a lot of deep twos, but that's mainly because most of his shots come from the three point line. So, we will be giving him a 93 ball because majority of his shots are threes, boy. If you watch him on this Bulls team, he's spotting up a lot and knocking things down. Down, and that's what I love to see from Lonzo because the truth of it is he isn't a great shot creator for himself Let's not lie now. We will be putting his you know, what I'm saying his layup up to a 79 I know an 80 would have allowed me to get that silver relentless finisher But we'll be going with a 79 just because we need to put the rest on close shot just so that we can get 20 Finishing badges now as you can see in total what we finish with happens to be 20 finishing badges with Hall of Fame, Limitless Takeoff, you know what I'm saying? I believe that is Putback Boss, Slithery Finisher, Teardropper, and Unstrippable, as well as Gold Posterize, the Lob City Finisher, Silver Mouse in the House, Bronze Fast Twitch, and Fearless Finisher, and Silver Acrobat. Then on the shooting side of the ball, damn near everything is gold outside of Clutch Shooter, Corner Specialist, Fade Ace, Set Shooter, Slippery Up Ball, Sniper, Volume Shooter, and Lucky Number 7, which happened to be Hall of Fame. And then we finish with a whole lot of gold on the playmaking side of the ball outside of Silver, Ankle Breaker, and Unpluckable, and Hall of Fame, Glue Hands, Break Starter, and Downhill. Now defensively, as you can guess, point guard, so you know all the perimeter stuff is at least gold with the two key ones being Hall of Fame, Hustler, Off-Ball, Pest, and Silver, Pogo, Stick, and Intimidator on a guard build. With 85 speed and 85 XL, this is something mean. So in total, that's 50, 88. Wait, is my match? No, but that ain't right. That's 50, 78, 94 total badge points on this thing. Right before you slap on the plus 7 that you get by completing all the previous seasons and finishing college. So in total, that is 104 badge points. And if you complete this season, that's 105. Now, when it comes to the primary takeover, the first thing I'm going to have to go with, because you know what I'm saying, I did say it is Lonzo, spot of precision, because he is mean when it comes to that. And then the secondary take that I'm going to go with is claps. If you have watched Lonzo Ball play defense, it is beautiful. It is artwork at its finest. Man, I sound like I'm standing out for Lonzo right now. But yeah, what 2K says we have happened to build here is, let's go say two-way sharpshooter, son. Two-way threat, the likes of Lonzo. Oh my God. We got Lonzo. Okay, cool. Yeah, two-way threat, the likes of Lonzo Ball, DeJounte Murray, and of course his little brother, LaMelo Ball. Because technically speaking, Leangelo is the only outlier in the Ball Brother family. The, the other two basically are copies of each other with just a little bit less potential on one side. But yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed today's build video. If you did, do me a favor, go ahead and drop a like on the video. If you're new to the channel, it does. So yeah, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And yeah, hit, if you want to see a Leangelo Ball video to finish the trifecta of the Ball family, then do me a favor, go ahead and comment hashtag free jello down below in the comments. But yeah, it's been your boy Alvin MB10, aka AMR10. I'll catch you in a bit. Deuces!